Hey guys, I'm going to do an update on the, my RC cars. My tracks is mainly, I'm not going to do the X mods because there's just too much crap around for them. Um, but anyway, for the Traxxas, um, I'm actually starting to run it now again because uh, I had motor issues and I, I don't know why, I could never get it to, the motor kept blowing up. I got a motor and it blew up in less than uh, two runs. So uh, I can't, I couldn't figure out why, but uh, it seems to work fine now. I've ran this two times already and it does, it's fantastic. It, it hauls ass down the street. Even with just um, the base one, it's nothing. It's got the seven cell um, battery and then with the Titan, I think they call it a uh, 12T turn something motor 500, I don't know. Something weird like that, but uh, I got this sweet charger for it. Um, it's called a, pr uh, correct me if I'm wrong, Profet or something like that, Sport 2 charger. Now you can set it to 4 amps, 3 amps, 2 amps, 1 amp with this button that you hold it to start it and shut it off and then you, after it's shut off you can select which ones. And then after it gets done charging, it beeps every 30 seconds to let you know that it's done. And then if you ignore it every 30 seconds, it'll do it every 90 seconds. And then after a while, it just shuts up. And then, um, but it has this cool thing where, it, um, where if it done when it's done, it stays solid. But then if it detects it going down anything like 0.1 or anything, I mean, because just anything, it um, sends a pulse and it brings it back up fast. But um, anyway, this is gets a little bit warm. Not it's not hot, it's not hot where you can't touch it, but it's it's pretty warm. Um, battery doing okay. I don't feel it. Yeah, it's not even warm. But um, been charging charges in less than pretty much under an hour. Works good. Uh, this thing hauls ass down the street though. I mean, like the tires get skinnier because uh, they're spinning so fast. It's amazing. I got um the 23 tooth gear on the motor, and then whatever the big gear is in it that it comes with. Um, not really, no upgrades to this thing, um, at all. It's just, uh, all stock, but I love it. It works great. Um, broken a few parts along the way. Broke a bulkhead back when I first got it, and, uh, haven't broken one since. I lost the, the shield guard somewhere along the way. It actually tore out on me, so I just leave it out. Um, controller works great. I don't even have to adjust the steering or anything. The trim control is dead center. Um works great. Here's the box for that charger. It comes with um, this adapter, but uh, you actually have to buy from Trax is another kind of adapter. So this way it'll work. So this way it connects to this kind of battery. Makes it go from this kind, I forget what they call that, to this high current one that Traxxas uses. But um, I don't know. It seems to work good. Been using it all day. I'm um, just getting ready for my trip. I got all my Traxxas cleaning stuff. Um, I'm going to try this if uh, my motor starts lagging it down. This is um, it's um, cleaner, plastic contact cleaner, but you, you can use it on electric motors too. And then um, got all my papers for the Traxxas and stuff and a whole bunch of parts. I need the lubricant WD-40 that I spray it down with if I ever get it wet. A couple old motors. I actually got one of the old motors working again, but it heats up after a while and it's, you can smell it burning, the brushes and stuff, so it's not greatest. But, um, I don't know, the tracks just, it just works great. Um, tires are still really good on it. I mean, like, they grip like mad on pavement. They're really good. And then, uh, they do really good off-road. It's got really good suspension. Um, I love the suspension on it. You can just drive over stuff. Like, I was driving my backyard, and it had pretty tall grass. And it was just going over the grass pretty well. And hit a bump here and there. The suspension would definitely take it. It was just, uh, it was working great. I couldn't, um, I'm, I forgot how good this truck was. But, um, only a couple things I'm concerned with. I'm going to have to get some kind of body for this because uh, there's actually cracks in the body. It's actually, um, you can't see it, but there's like a crack in the body there. Yeah, you can. There you go. Now you can see it. Same thing on the other side. It's from when this thing does wheelies. You can get a wheelie bar, but I'm too fucking lazy. It goes like that, and then it catches the pavement and tears this back like that and tears the whole body up. I haven't flipped it too many times. The body's still in pretty good condition. It's got some scratches up here and then on the corners, but... The hood isn't that scratched in the front. It's got a couple scratches right there, but it's not really that scratched. It's all really good. Got my computer here all set up. So, yeah. I haven't done anything in a while with uh, RC cars, but uh, I was just amazed how good this thing ran today, and I figured I'd just make an update. Nothing much to it, though. Um, I'm starting to wear down the back tires pretty good. Um, they're, even though they don't look like it, they, you can feel that they're a lot more worn down than this. So, um... Yeah, but um, 
this charger is neat. I'll show you how it works. You can shut it off by that. Makes different sounds too. That's when it's not charging, it just stays solid. And then when you turn it on, it flashes when she tar uh, when it charges. And then when it gets on, it has a solid light. And then every once in a while, it blinks because it sends that pulse to the battery or whatever. But uh, I got my other batteries charging for this. Just getting it all ready because I'm going on vacation, driving around the beach. That's always fun. They say not to do it, but what the hell. But uh, in a little bit after vacation, I'm going to see if I can get a uh, brushless system for it and see how it does. should be fun. But uh, there you guys go. Um, that's just uh, the Stampede. If you guys want any more information or maybe even seeing it run, I can make a video. Thanks, guys, for watching, and bye.